to all NA employees and NA building occupants. The coronavirus disease, COVID-19, has been in our midst for almost six months now. As it became a global pandemic by mid-March of 2020, President Rodrigo Roa Duterte has signed Republic Act 11469 or the Bayanihan Act or the Bayanihan to Heal as One Act and created the Interagency Task Force, IETF, for the management of infectious diseases to mitigate the risk of infection, reduce the spread of the virus, and to help flatten the curve. The President has constantly and repeatedly called for the cooperation of all Filipinos and to help overcome this unseen enemy that has so adversely affected all our lives. And now, I am echoing this call on every Nayan and all occupants of the NAE building. Naya has always won with the Philippine government and the whole world in this fight. Hence, NEA has issued and implemented several policies, guidelines, advisories, and mitigating measures among which are the minimum health standards and COVID-19 response protocol. Now, more than ever, I urge everyone to familiarize themselves with these guidelines which are readily accessible at the NAE Outlook, NAE Facebook page, HRAD Facebook page, and NAE website. Keep yourselves informed and updated. The prime goal of the NAE management is the safety, good health, and security of all NAE officials, service partners, and other building occupants of the NAE building, notwithstanding ensuring the continuance of the operation of the agency and its uninterrupted delivery of service to all electric cooperatives, the member, consumer owners, stakeholders, business partners, and the general public. Maintaining the NA workplace COVID-free is a shared commitment and joint responsibility of all of us. We must take preventions and mitigating measures to contain this pandemic seriously and urgently. Let us be one in doing something extraordinary as we battle out this pandemic. Let us be not just warriors of light, but warriors of, for life. Let us do our share in making our community and our world a safer place to live in. I thank you for your utmost cooperation, and I am thanking each and everyone for your abiding cooperation and continued support. Keep safe and stay healthy.